Hello and welcome back. This is Matthias with Yellow Case Imaging and I'm going to show you a little trick here. If you've ever wondered when using your email how to reply to a, um, a message that contains an attachment and keep that attachment in the reply, I'm going to show you. So I'm going to go to my email here. This is my Apple Mail. And you'll notice I have this email that was sent to me by some spam or something, but it includes a <laughs> some sort of taxidermy um, I have no idea what this is, but some sort of uh, graphic. Let's uh, see what happens if I click to reply to this email by either hitting the reply uh, icon here in the message or by clicking on the reply up here. It doesn't really matter. Same thing. So if I go to reply, you'll notice that that graphic disappears. And I can type, I have no need for such a thing. You'll notice the graphic is not here, and if I were to reply, this graphic would not be included. But what if somebody actually sent me something important, and I wanted to reply with the graphic attached once again so that I could make reference to it for some reason? So let's pretend that this graphic actually is uh, useful to me. What I want to do, if I want to include this in a reply, is to go up here to Edit, Attachments, include original attachments in reply. If I select that, it is now permanently on until I remove it. I'm going to go back, edit, attachments. You'll notice there's a little checkbox next to include original attachments in reply. That means that this feature is now turned on. So if I re reply to this email, that graphic is now embedded once again in the email reply. So I could say something like, this sounds great. I have an elephant to send to you. All right, so um, this is how to turn that feature on. If you want to turn it on momentarily, you're gonna have to go back and turn it off when you're done by selecting it one more time. Edit, Attachments, and then select the first option and that feature will stop uh, embedding the image in your replies. So um, I've been asked that question before, how to do that? Well, that's how. Hope this helps.